Good evening, everyone. I'm Nick Brennan. GOP presidential candidate John Kasich was in the UP today. He held a town hall event at the Marquette Ramada Inn. TV 6's Sophie Erber was there and has more. Governor John Kasich touched down at Sawyer International Airport early this afternoon. He stopped by Togo's for a quick sandwich, UP style. Provolone, lettuce, raw green peppers, tomatoes, Southwest Ranch. I mean, how can you do better than that? Meanwhile, the crowd at the Ramada was gathering, standing room only. There was an energy in the crowd and the buzzing you can feel throughout the, the town. In the crowd today, familiar faces in local politics. State Representative Ed McBroom and State Senator Tom Casperson among them. As governor of Ohio, Kasich himself is no stranger to the Great Lakes region. Michigan and Ohio, I mean, we're right, we're kissing cousins. I mean, there's not a, a dime's worth of difference. I've been here many, many times, but coming up here, this is special. He discussed everything from fixing flaws in the Social Security system to schools and rebuilding our military. He also took questions from the audience and joked about the Michigan State and Ohio State rivalry in sports. Give in. There's not a substitute for big leadership. Just ask Tom Izzo and he'll tell you, okay? <laughs> Throughout the town hall event today, Kasich stressed the importance of family values. And especially in the UP, family is really important. And I think he came across as an authentic guy, which he is. And it really resonated with the voters in the room, you could just tell. Sharing the stage with Kasich today were students from all across the UP. Not all were Republicans either. But they were very impressed with what he did come here saying today. He talks about himself being kind of a crossover candidate, that he can get some of those Democratic votes. He's not a real partisan guy. He doesn't kind of go after the other guys real hard. He just tells you what he's going to do. The governor also talked about staying true to Upper Michigan traditions while broadening our horizons. Uh, we're always going to need mining. We're always going to need iron. I mean, it's just a fact of life. And uh, so these things tend to go in, in, in peaks and valleys, but we don't want to give up on manufacturing, but we want to diversify the UP so you can be more than just a one-trick pony. You want to be able to do uh, lots of different things, and small businesses are the key. But the strength of our country doesn't rest in a bunch of politicians who come galloping into the UP to fix all your problems. That's why I talk about neighborhood and community and mom and dad and family. The state has been rising. We watch their numbers. The jobs have been coming back. I think there's rainbows in the future. After his stop in Marquette, Governor Kasich was headed downstate to Saginaw. He really resonated with the crowd here today and the voters seemed enthusiastic to get to the polls on Tuesday. Reporting in Marquette, Sophie Erber, TV6 News.